to point, obviously, today. Can I ask you, was that about Southampton's defending or was that more about your team's struggles to break through? Uh, I think both. Both. And uh, they were very good. They defended very well. And uh, uh, to find space, uh, it wasn't uh, easy. And uh, But at the same time, I think that uh, we can do much better. And to move the ball uh, 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 more more quick, more quickly, and um, sometimes to try also to to find the one we want. And uh, I think I think that uh, to to play after uh, uh, two days, not not two days, but uh, forty five hours, uh, is not easy for uh, for every team. And I think that uh, uh, I have seen a bit of fatigue in uh, my players. And uh, I think also that uh, for this reason, uh, we, we make uh, sometimes not, not the, the good decision. No? And uh, in um, the last pass uh, to finishing, and um, yeah, we can do much better. But it's not easy. I know very well that it's not easy to play after only 40, 44 hours that you played uh, the previous game. Um, can I ask you just quickly what you made of the uh, the Harry Kane, well, should, uh, a goal that would have been that was ruled out by VAR? Have you managed to see it back yet? Yeah, but I think uh, I scored uh, twice, one a penalty and then uh, uh, the second goal. But uh, I think that uh, I don't want to comment the referee decision or VAR decision and uh, they are there to try to to do their best, and we hope every time that uh, they they make the best decision. Thank you, Jonathan Bill. Continue next. Hi, Antonio. Uh, Stephen Bergwijn wasn't involved today. Is he injured? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, during the game uh, against uh, Crystal Palace, uh, and uh, yeah, he felt uh, a problem. Uh, in his calf, and uh, yeah, he was injured uh, together uh, Lo Celso and uh, Romero and uh, Sessegnon. Will any of those players be back for Sunday? Saturday, sorry. I don't think. I don't think so. I don't think so. And uh, he has a muscular problem, and I think he need uh, to recover more time than uh, than only ten uh, ten days or one week. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks, Patrick. Hi, um, Antonio. You used a... Sorry, Dan. I'll try again. Uh, hi, Antonio. Can you hear me? I'm well, It may be okay now. Can you speak now, please, Dan? Can you hear me okay? Yeah, fine now. Yeah, you're Yeah, fine. Uh, hi, Antonio. You used um, Delhi in a slightly different role it looked like today he was kind of playing from the right hand side I thought can you just talk me through what your thinking was behind using Delhi there and, and say what you thought about his performance yeah he played uh, like a uh, 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 like a number eight and we played uh, we started to play with the uh, wings in front of the um, the defensive line on the left, uh, Obier, on the right, uh, Delhi. Yeah. And uh, he, he, he did uh, in the same way like the other. Yeah. And uh, today I decided to, to make uh, three rotations. Then uh, the game against the Crystal Palace, Davis for Tanganga, and uh, uh, Wixi for, uh, for uh, Skip. And then uh, um, daily for uh, for Lucas. And don't don't forget to repeat that uh, uh, we faced the COVID and uh, many many players were affected of, of the COVID. And uh, I had to try to manage the situation in, uh, in uh, the best possible way. And uh, um, yeah, I decided to do these uh, three rotations. And uh, yeah, that's all. Last question from Tony Banks. Hi, Antonio. 
Are you not um, a bit annoyed that your team faced a team with 10 men for more than a half? And you, you know, is this an opportunity missed, do you think, for three points? Yeah, for sure. For sure, uh, it was an opportunity that we missed. And uh, when it happened this type of situation, you have to try to exploit this situation and uh, to try to get three points. Also because uh, 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 we knew very well that to play against Southampton uh, in this stadium uh, is, uh, is not easy. And the situation uh, at one point of the game was, uh, was uh, positive for, uh, for us. But uh, as I said to you before, I think that in the second half we felt uh, the fatigue and uh, our mind wasn't clear to, to make the best decision. Uh, can, can happen this. And uh, I tried also with substitution to change something and Lucas Mora in. And um, Jill, in the first half, I decided to change uh, Reguillon because uh, yeah, he booked a, a yellow card. And uh, I think it was uh, much better in this, in this way. But uh, then uh, uh, we didn't find the solution to score, but not we didn't find because we scored, no? We scored, but uh, at the same time, they decided to disallow the goal. 